jiggles and she's brave. She can be jiggly. Yeah, this is Gabo, he's a very bouncy goat. He loves you to bite. And eats too much. Pardon? There's a dinky little donkey named of Dash. If you're in trouble, in a flash. This is Digger, he's a happy little pup. Early morning on Big Barn Farm, and Digger is hanging around the farmhouse door in the hope of some tasty scraps of food. Oh, thanks. Uh, oh. There you go, Digger. You're in luck. A lovely, tasty bone. Digger thinks it's his lucky day. Until he overhears the farmer say something he wishes he'd never heard. He's got to go. What's that, Digger? What did he say? He said he's got to go. Surely he didn't mean you. <laughs> hey, Digger, wait! Don't run away. Oh, dear. I think Digger's worried. <laughs> hey, Digger, what's up? I was outside the kitchen and the farmer said he's got to go. Calm down, Digger. Calm down. We can't understand you. Got to go? Oh, who's got to go? <gasps> the farmer said he's got to go. Someone's got to go? A uh, he? He could be me. Or he could be me. Oh, me. It, it, it's oh, no. I'm sure, I'm sure it's, it's me. me. Don't no, panic. It's me. Gobo, Dash oh, and Digger are worried oh, now. No, it's me. Don't yep. panic! Thank you, Petal. It's all right for you not to panic, Petal. The farmer said he's got to go, and you're a she. Hmm, Gobo's got a point. The farmer did say he's got to go. Gobo, Dash and Digger are beginning to wonder whether they've done something which has upset the farmer. I'm sure it's me. Why, Gobo? Well, I found a pie that I thought the farmer's wife had left out for me. I just started tucking in when I heard the farmer's wife say, Who's eaten the middle of my pie? Oops. So you see, it's probably me. No, I think it's probably me. I know I'm stubborn. I wouldn't leave my lovely grassy field when the farmer wanted me to help him in the yard. Come on, Dash. But I don't want to. That was a bit stubborn, Dash. Hee-haw, hee-haw, hee-haw. Dash, hee -haw, it's hee -haw, Sunday morning and it's very early. Oh, well. Hee-haw, <laughs> hee-haw. <laughs> so, you see, it's most likely me. Oh, it's me. It's me. I'm the one who's got to go. Why, Digger? What's gone wrong? Well, it all started when I accidentally took the farmer's slipper last week. Mm, then I accidentally chewed it. And then I accidentally tore it to shreds. Oh, that is bad. So it must be me who's got to go. Oh dear. It seems they've all been in a spot of bother recently. Petal's having a chat with the Mrs Chickens. They've all done some silly things. Silly? Who's silly? Silly? Who's silly? No one's silly, actually. It's just Digger has heard that somebody has got to go. Got to go? Who's got to go? We don't know. But don't tell anyone, will you? Oh, got to go. Got to go. Who's got to go? Who's got to go? Somebody's got to go. Somebody's got to go. Your secret's safe with us. Who's got to go? Don't worry, Petal. They won't breathe a word. Who's got to go? Don't tell anyone, but someone's got to go. No. You're joking. It's not us. Is it? Is it? Someone's got to go. Don't tell anyone. Go. Someone's got to go. Someone's got to go. Someone's got to go. Who's going? Keep it under your hat, madame. But someone's got to go. Moolay. 
Hello, one of the meter pie. And me the noise on a Sunday. Oh, the Sunday. Oh. They all have Ooh. to go. They will. They'll all have to go. Definitely. I agree, Mac. The farmyard bunch have got to go? Ooh la la. This is just the beginning. Who will be next? Ooh, ooh, I need answers. No one, madame. Don't panic. This is how rumours start. It's just one of the farmyard bunch heard. Heard, therefore the chop. I've heard this happen on other farms. They get rid of one or two of us animals, and the rest aren't far behind. Oh, no, this is all getting out of hand. Apparently, we're all going... All of us? No, no, I... Oh, what's the use? Maybe Petal shouldn't have mentioned it to the Mrs. Chickens. They'll be friends forever down on Big Farm Farm. It's silly. One of the ducks just told me the whole farm is closing down. Really? No, it's just a silly rumour. The fact is, Digger heard the farmer say he's got to go. But the question still is, who's got to go? I think it's definitely me, because I heard the farmer say it. The rest of the Big Barn farm animals are waiting to find out who's got to go. <laughs> well, Digger, who's it going to be? Digger has decided because he was the first to hear the farmer say it, he's the one to go. But not you, Digger. Yes, I was the one who heard it first. The farmyard bunch are very sad, as Digger has decided that he'll go. We can't let Digger go. Why don't we hide him? Then he can't go. Yes, why not? It's worth a go. Where? Hmm, what about up a tree? Nice try, Dash. But the tree is very tall. And Digger can't really climb. Hey, what about hiding him behind the barn? Sorry, Gobo. The ducks will see him there. I know. We'll hide him under that straw. Here in the barn. A perfect hiding place, Petal. Here he comes now. Hmm. Glad you're back, Digger. We've had an idea. Digger, we're going to hide you under this straw. Quick, hide. <laughs> Thank you. But I don't want to hide. I've decided I'm going to go. I'll pack my things. Oh. Well, at least we can do something nice for him before he goes. Poor Digger is collecting all his things together before he goes. Come on, Digger. What belongs to you? Uh, how about this milking bowl? <laughs> Digger, that doesn't belong to you. That belongs to the farmer. Mm. Au revoir, Digger. Bye, madame. Digger, the saddle belongs to Mac the horse, of course. You're looking for your things. Oh, aha. What about a bone and a blanket? <sighs> That's more like it. See you later, young Digger. <laughs> so Digger's found his bone and blanket, along with his favourite squeaky toy. Come on, Digger. The others have a surprise for you. They're holding a goodbye and good luck party for Digger. We did some party food for you. Carrots, a bit of leftovers, grass and, and some biscuits. Yum! Oh, thanks, but I'm not very hungry. No one's really in the party mood, except the ducks. The ducks are always in the party mood. Right, eh? You look cool. Love what you've done to your feathers. Oh, thanks for all this, but it really is time for me to go. Bye, Bye Digger. Digger. So long. Love you. Oops. It's OK, Gobo. We all love Digger. <laughs> Digger's gone up to the farmhouse to tell the farmer he's ready to go. 
It looks like the car is ready to take him away. <gasps> it's a dog cage. Bye-bye, <laughs> farm. He's ready to go. Hmm. Here we go, then. Hang on a minute. I think I see old Pop coming. Old Pop. Old Pop. Old Pop. Old Pop. Old Pop. It's Old Pop. It looks as if old Pop's hurt his paw. Old Pop! Hello, Digger. I've got a bit of trouble with the old paw. Trot on something sharp. Old Pop explains that he has to go to the vet. The vet? Yes, I've got to go. You've got to go? Yes, I've got to go to the vet. But don't worry, I'll be back in an hour. Bye. Bye. Oh, so he had to go. Old Pop. That's more like it. The Farmyard Bunch are back together. You have been silly. Of course, I knew Digger didn't have to go all along. But from now on, I'm never ever going to be so stubborn. So when the farmer asks me to do something... Come on, Dash. I'll do it. Never, ever, ever going to chew another slipper ever again. I mustn't chew it. I mustn't chew it. Hmm. How about you, Gobo? Are you going to behave from now on? Well, I'll never, ever, ever, ever eat any more pies. Ever. Yum, apple pie, my favourite. Mm -hmm. Well done, Gobo. But some things are just beyond my control. Uh, Gobo? Gobo? Oops, pardon. That's all for now. See you again soon down on Big Barn Farm. This is Petal, she's a piglet and she's brave. She can be cheeky. Can she never say? This is Gobo, he's a very bouncy goat. He loves to play and eats all day. Uh, pardon? There's a dinky little donkey named of Dash. If you're in trouble, oh, yeah. in a flash. This is Digger, he's a happy little pup. Is he cute? Dead right. Can he bark? Not quite. Oh, oh, oh. The ducks are splashing in and out the pond. Oh, the gossip, gossip, all day long. Madame is French and lovely. Oh, yeah. And we all know who goes cock a doodle doo. Mrs. Snuffles and her piglets come to play. And on pop, make sure that everyone is safe. Who's the tallest of them all? It's the horse. And last, not least, their friends. Now you've seen them all together. And they love to be together. They'll be friends forever down on